Hi, my name is Yuya Matsushima, and our members are Saiko Yokoyama and Konran. We are from Shiraki Zemira of Political Science and Economics Faculty. Uh, we are grateful for excellent classes at the university every day. Thanks to you, we are facing the danger of losing our job. Let me first explain that. As you all know, the world now is going through rapid globalization. The world is becoming more and more flat, and this means you can learn the newest information no matter where you are. So now, we would like to post some questions. What is the role of a university in the modern days? Is there anyone who more innovative and entrepreneurial spirit than Bill Gates? Is there anyone who can speak about applicable business management better than Jack Welch? Is there anyone who can talk politics with more passion than a president? Now is the time we have to learn from them. We are not only part of an exclusive club from top universities, we are just part of the world's population. Let's look at this chart showing the grow GDP growth of major countries. As you can see, the growth is rapid. In the near future, perhaps people all around the world will have the same high level skills and knowledge, or at least within Asia itself. In this way, Asian countries will be catching up with developed countries in the near future. Also, the population of people with access to internet is growing in great speed. On the other hand, let's look at the income levels in Asia. On the graph by Mitsubishi Tokyo UFJ Bank, it shows the monthly salary of the blue card workers, engineers, and managers respectively. Countries reading today's Asian economy such as Japan and Korea actually have low cost performance in terms of income levels. So can you guess what can happen? We are in danger of losing our job. With a relative decline in the level of education, universities will lose their appeal, and employees of universities like you may also be at risk of losing your job. Don't become discouraged. There are solutions to this. We have secret weapon. And what is this secret weapon that universities can provide? Well, it's network. Excellent students and teachers who can provide excellent students, not only can they become leaders of the world, and they are also huge assets. In order for everyone around the world to obtain high levels of skills and maximize their proposal, potential, we propose the following. And this proposal is not just for students. Education is no longer just about teaching. We need to focus on other aspects outside of the teaching realm. Yes, for example, spreading information. We are probably thinking, I'm already doing that in school, making presentations, etc. But well, this is the outcome, end product. Do you think this is showing great results? Sadly, we have not taken and are not taking courses to teach us presentations. In fact, there are not many courses focusing on presentations available. We have learned it ourselves through watching TED, through taking part in terminals. Yes, we can learn ourselves. Even though we are able to learn about presentations, we don't exactly have opportunities to put what we have learned to use. And we would like to take this opportunity to thank you for giving us this awesome opportunity to use our presentational skills. What I want to say is that, how about giving us more chances like this? We have put in a lot of time to get here. However, all that time investment was worth the while. Spreading information and transmitting our thoughts to people is valuable on its own. Wanting to come to Korea is not our, it's not our only reason. I swear, 
maybe I shouldn't. All right, now back to the main subject. Only chosen people are given the chance to voice their views in front of a mass audience. Although anyone can obtain the newest information, not everyone has the ability to spread information, and this ability will set the individuals apart. Only selected people are given the rare opportunity to practice transmitting and presenting information. Why is that the case? Here we want to show a more elaborate plan. Why not have students present half the class, with teachers or professors playing the supporting role? Students make their presentation based on their review and preparations beforehand, as instructed by their teachers. There are three benefits to this. Students who present will strive to study the knowledge related to their presentation. Not only that, they will also strive to overcome their fear of speaking in front of others, such as your teachers, peers, boyfriends, girlfriends. And, all, and through this, they will gain and maximize their ability to transmit and present information. Secondly, not only will work become easier for teachers, both teachers and students can learn from new knowledge from one another. Win-win. Third, audience can also learn more effectively through listening to a good presentation. And from my experience, sometimes I find it easier to understand a concept when my like-minded peers are the ones doing the explanation as opposed to when my teachers are the one teaching them to me. And if the presentation was not up to your standard, you will be forced to learn by yourself rather than just being satisfied that we have listened well, sometimes have listened, and copied all the notes that a teacher has given. There is a benefit for everyone in this. Also, we should share great presentations on the big World Wide Web. There are two merits to this. For example, our majors are political science and economics. Macro and microeconomics is a huge area where students seem to struggle with the struggle with, and sometimes it is due to the difference in level of teaching within professors. Some students even go as far as to crashing other classes in order to understand the content that was taught in their own class. So with our plan, students no longer need to do that. We can study at our own pace and in the comfort of our own homes. And if the materials are translated into different languages, we will be available to, have, to the best lectures worldwide, and students who have the passion will be able to learn and motivate Students who have the passion to learn will be motivated to learn even more. Now, the other merit. We can showcase to the world excel the excellence that students can create. Being able to share our ideas with the world is an extremely important and appealing trait that we all need. This can also be a good way for employers looking to hire students to assess the ability of students. So through effectively making use of the network that universities can provide, we are allowing students to step on the world stage, speeding up the process of information sharing. People without the financial ability to study abroad can now have the platform to, to the best and learn from the best from around the world and even make their own contributions through sharing information. And regardless of the current position of any country, it has become a time when individual abilities play an important role. And finally, we believe that this is real equality and it will help Asia grow. And finally, we would like to give thanks once again for this opportunity and hopefully it will prepare us to be the leaders of tomorrow. Thank you.